Hello guys, welcome back to my channel VFX Expert. So guys, in this today's class, we are going to see how to export camera from Maya to After Effects using Maya Live Link. So now we are inside Maya here and I am using this Maya 2022 version and just I have created this basic scene inside Maya. So simple you can see I have created some planes. So this is our ground plane and these are two some other planes and this is our camera which just I have animated inside Maya. So you can see this is our camera animations. Now just click on these panels and just select camera from these panels and just simply play and check. So in this camera view I have also checked about this film gate. So yeah just you have to check this one so you will get this frame here. Now simply just we can play and check. So this is our camera animations and just select camera so you will get all these keys here. So inside the timeline you can see. Now before exporting this camera to After Effects first we have to do some settings. So first we have to click on this render settings and just we have to define over this frame size or you can say these presets so here i have selected this 1080 which is 1980 so same size composition you will get inside after effects so whatever value you will define it here so same size resolution composition you will get inside after effects now just close this one here second thing we can also define over this timeline range so here i have defined this one here so maybe 100 frame timeline just i have created inside Maya. Now finally just I am going to export this camera animation from Maya to After Effects using Maya Live Link. So first we have to click on File, then we have to click on Adobe After Effects Live Link. So first we have to run this Live Link inside Maya. So you can see this one here, AE Live Link and waiting for connection. Now after this we have to open After Effects. So now we are inside After Effects and also we have to run Maya Live Link script inside After Effects. For this we have to click on Window, then Extensions and just we have to select this Autodesk Maya Live Link script inside After Effects. So remember this one, before exporting your camera from Maya to After Effects, first we have to install this script inside After Effects. So again I am using this After Effects 2022 version. So this script just you have to install which is compatible with After Effects 2022 version. And suppose if you are using After Effects 2020 then you can also install this Autodesk Maya Live Link script which is compatible After Effects 2020 okay. So according to your version you have to install this Maya Live Link script inside After Effects okay. So now just we have to select this Autodesk Maya Live Link script. So you will get this window which is actually showing Autodesk Maya Live Link and this is just showing this actually scene name. Now again just we have to check inside Maya. So now we are inside Maya. So this is connected to Maya scene. So this is actually about this Maya scene name or file name. So you can see here. Now after this just we have to select all these elements which you want to export from Maya to After Effects. So from this outline just we have to select all these planes and also this camera. Then simply hold middle mouse button and just simply you can drag and drop here. Then after this we have to click on this push all. So this will send all these items from Maya to After Effects. So just simply we have to click. Now again we have to open After Effects. So now if you will check inside After Effects. So you will get all these elements which you have exported from Maya. So inside this timeline simply you can check. So this is our camera and all these planes here. So by default After Effects will convert all these planes into this solid. So if you want you can also check inside this one here. So all these planes converted into just a solid layer here. And this is our camera here. So now after this what we have to do just simply we have to check our this camera animation inside After Effects. So just we can play and check. So now this is looking good here. Then after this what we can do because actually all planes are showing in same colors here so just simply we can select any plane and just we can apply any effect so just click on effects generate and just select this gradient ramp so usually just we can see about all these planes here now if you want to give some colors then just you can select this plane then effect control panel and just simply you can change this color and then again just apply this gradient ramp and if you want you can just select this radial ramp just select any color 
so like this you can export any camera animations or camera from maya to after effects then after this suppose if you want to place any uh, images or video instead of all these planes here so simply what we can do suppose so now for just i'm going to import some images inside after effects so again we have to click on file import file and just select your pictures now just place any images inside this timelines here so one more thing so suppose if you will select this composition so you will get this 920 1080 frame size compositions inside after effect because you have defined this frame size in maya render settings okay so according to requirement first we have to define all these frame size inside maya just select this image and just place into this timeline now just convert this layer into 3d layer presses for scaling then after this just we have to select this plane now press p p for position just copy this one control c and select this uh, image now again press p then select this one now control v now just select this plane and just hide so you can see so same as just you can also place any picture at this solid positions here so again just second one drag and drop so just we have to convert this image into 3d layer then scale down select this plane and find the position so press p for position ctrl c copy ctrl v so automatic this will place at this actually layer position see now just we can resize now just simply we can play and check so you can see this camera animation so like this is you can place any object then you can convert into 3d layer then after this you can place into this scene and just simply you can affect with your camera enemy you can see now suppose if you want to add one more plane so again we have to go to maya so now we are inside maya then again just create another plane so just select this one ctrl d for duplicate press w and just move just create planes so then only this will convert automatic into solid not create any cube otherwise this will not convert into solid so this will just only place just stay in the object so again just only for reference just create a cube so you can see this one just i created one cube so again just we have to select this plane and just place into this area so here i have selected and also just select this, just select this cube so now just select both items and click this push all now just again we have to come inside after effects so now again so you will get this plane which is just type created new plane inside maya and instead of this cube you will get actually this locator so you can see this locator so now suppose you want to place any object at this locator position so just uh, this is just only for experience and just delete this one here now just take another images so this is just suppose i have selected this one now again just take this text and type it here so anything just you can type now convert this 2d layer into 3d layer and after this again just find this null position so maybe maybe this one which is actually showing here this cube now p for position select this one ctrl c copy and just paste it here ctrl v so you will get this text here and let little bit of scale your text Many things just you can add here according to requirement and just move it here. So what I am going to do just select this text and just move little bit in G position. So like this just you can place any element into this scene and just you can move according to your camera movements here. So guys till here I have completed about this class how you can export camera from Maya to After Effects using Maya Live Link. So guys if you like this video. Please watch, share, comment and subscribe my channel if you are still not subscribed my channel. So thanks for watching.